Question 1. What is an ABAP instance? Answer. When you call a function module, an instance of its function group plus its data is loaded into the memory area of the internal session. An ABAP program can load several instances by calling function modules from different function groups. Question 2. What is SAP R 3? Answer. SAP R 3 refers to systems application and product for data processing real time having a three tier architecture, i.e., presentation layer, application layer, and database layer. Question 3. What are the contents in technical specifications? Answer. There are five contents in technical settings data class, size category, buffering permission, buffering type, and logging. Question 4 What is function group? Difference between function group and function module. Answer Function groups act as containers for function modules that logically belong together. Function groups 1 These cannot be defined in a function module. 2 It cannot be called. 3 They are containers for function module. Function modules 1 These must be defined in a function group 2 it can be called from any program 3 they are not containers for function group question 5 what function does data dictionary perform answer central information repository for application and system data the above dictionary contains data definitions metadata that allow you to describe all of the data structures in the system like tables views and data types in one place this eliminates redundancy question 6 difference between domain and data data element what are aggregate object answer domain specifies the technical attributes of a data element its data type length possible values and appearance on the screen each data element has an underlying domain a single domain can be the basis for several data elements domains are objects in the above dictionary data element describes the business function of a table field its technical attributes are based on a domain and its business function is described by its field labels and documentation aggregate object views march code and lock objects are called aggregate objects because they are formed from several related table. Question 7. What is view? Different types of view. Explain. Answer. View. A view is a virtual table containing fields from one or more tables. A virtual table that does not contain any data but instead provides an application-oriented view of one or more above dictionary tables. Different types of view. Maintenance. Database. It is on more than two tables. Projection. It is only on one table. Help. Question 8. What is sequence of event triggered in report? Answer. There are six events in report. Initialization. At selection screen. Start of selection. Get. Get late. End of selection. Top of page. End of page. At line selection. At user command. At pf. Nn. Question 9. What are standard layout sets in the SAP script? Answer. There are four standard layouts in the SAP script. Header. Logo. Main window. Footer. Question 10. What are the system fields? Explain. Answer. The above system fields are active in all above programs. They are filled by the runtime environment and you can query their values in a program to find out particular states of the system. Although they are variables, you should not assign your own values to them since this may overwrite in information that is important for the normal running of the program. However, there are some isolated cases in which you may need to overwrite a system variable. For example, by assigning a new value to the field style synth, you can control navigation within details lists. Question 11. Explain what is a logical database. Answer. Logical databases are special above programs that retrieve data and make it available to application programs. Use of LDB is used to read data from database tables by linking them to executable above programs. Question 12. Explain what are the events used for logical database. Answer. There are two events. Get. This is the most important event for executable programs that use a logical database. It occurs when the logical database has read a line from the node and made it available to the program in the work area declared using the statement node stable tag. The depth to which the logical database read is determined by the get statements. Put. The put statement directs the program flow according to the structure of the logical database. Question 13. Explain what are interactive reports? Answer. An output list which displays just the basic details and allow user to interact so that a new list is populated based on user selection. With interactive list, the user can actively control data retrieval and display during the session. Question 14. Different types of loss. What are they? Answer. 
two types of Lua, DB Lu. A database Lu is the mechanism used by the database to ensure that its data is always consistent. A database Lu is an inseparable sequence of database operations that ends with a database commit. The database Lu is either fully executed by the database system or not at all. Once a database Lu has been successfully executed, the database will be in a consistent state. If an error occurs within a database Lu, all of the database changes since the beginning of the database Lu are reversed. SAP Lu, a logical unit consisting of dialog steps, whose changes are written to the database in a single database Lu is called an SAP Lu. Unlike a database Lu, an SAP Lu can span several dialog steps and be executed using a series of different work processes. Question 15. If I forgot some command in SAP script for example, suppress zero display, how to do find it? Answer. Suppressing of entire screens is possible with this command. This command allows us to perform screen processing in the background. Suppressing screens is useful when we are branching to list mode from a transaction dialog step.